Hello friends, today we will discuss some important questions of Geography Chapter 4, Geography of Assam. The questions may come as multiple choice questions or short questions. So let us see the first question. Assam is bounded by how many Indian states and foreign countries? Answer, 7 Indian states and 2 foreign countries. Question number 2. Write the latitudes and longitudes of Assam. Answer. Assam extends from 24 degree 9 minutes north to 27 degree 58 minutes north latitudes and 89 degree 42 minutes east to 96 degree 1 minute east longitudes. Question number 3. As per population data of 2001 and 2011, what percent of the population of Assam live in rural and urban areas? Answer. Here, rural areas, urban areas. 2001, 87.10%, 12.90%. 2011, 85.90%, 14.09%. Question number 4. What percent of Assam's population live in the Brahmaputra Valley? Answer. About 85 percent. Question number 5. What are the main causes of population growth in Assam? Answer. The main causes of population growth in Assam are Number 1. The natural growth of population. Point number 2. The large-scale migration to Assam from outside. Question number 6. Which is the oldest system of transport? Answer. Road transport. Question number 7. How many types of roads are there in the road transport system of Assam? What are they? Answer. 7 types. They are surfaced road, unsurfaced road, national highway, state highway, major district road, rural road, and urban road. Question number 8. Assam comes under which railway zone? Answer. Northeast Frontier Railway. Question number 9. According to 2012-13 data, what is the total length of rail lines in Assam? Answer. 2458.93 km. Question number 10. Full forms. CIWC. Central Inland Waterways Corporation, DIWT, Directorate of Inland Water Transport, IWT, Inland Water Transport. Question number 11. Name two government agencies which are engaged in promoting the water transport system of Assam. Answer. Number one, the Central Inland Waterways Corporation. Number two, the Directorate of Inland Water Transport. Question number 12. Name the civil airports of Assam. Answer. Guwahati, Tezpur, Zorhat, Dibrugar, North Lakhimpur, Silsar, and Thubri. Question number 13. In which district the Rupsi Airport is located? Answer. Thubri. Question number 14. Name the only international airport in whole Northeast India. Answer. Lokopriya Gopinath Bordoloi International Airport. Question number 15. According to the data of 2009-10, what percent of Assam's land was brought under cultivation? Answer. About 35 percent. Question number 16. According to the data of 2011-10, what is the total forest area of Assam? Answer 16,832 km square. Question number 17. What percent of the total forest areas of Assam fall under the reserved forest? Answer 72 percent. Question number 18. At present, how many national parks and wildlife sanctuaries are there in Assam? Answer. 
seven national parks and 20 wildlife sanctuaries. Question number 19. Where was the first oil exploration done in Assam? Answer, Digboy. Question number 20. Which is the oldest oil field in India? Answer, Digboy. Question number 21. What percent of India's total production of natural gas is produced in Assam? Answer, about 25%. Question number 22. Name the major minerals found in Assam. Answer, coal, mineral oil, natural gas, and limestones. Question number 23. How many types of soils are found in Assam? Answer, four types. Question number 24. Where are the new alluvial oils and old alluvial soils found in Assam? Answer, the new alluvial soils are found on the flood plains and riverside plains of the Brahmaputra and the Barak rivers and their tributaries. This type of soil is suitable for cultivation of rice, jute, pulses, and vegetables. The old alluvial soils are found on the higher plains of the Brahmaputra and Barak rivers. These soils are fertile and suitable mainly for rice and tea cultivation. Question number 25. What are the major causes for the crisis of natural resources? Answer. Point number one. Resources get polluted and damaged. Point number two, resources become scarce. Point number three, severe environmental and socioeconomic problems arise. Dear friends, some more questions are left from this chapter. We will discuss those questions in our next video. Thank you for watching the video. For more videos, please like, share and subscribe the channel. Thank you.